In this video, I'm going to show you how to download up to 50,000 rows of data for a dimension from Workspace. In Workspace today, you can see up to 400 rows at a time in a table, after which we paginate so that you can see additional rows on additional pages. But occasionally, it's useful to look at all the data at once. For example, in this case where we have 7,071 pages, it might be useful to see them all at once outside of analysis workspace. You may want to you know, more easily manipulate the data, run some calculations on the data, or just scan the full list of data against your metrics and segments. So to do this, we've added in a right-click option. It's called right-click download items as CSV. It will be post-pended with the dimension that you're going to export the 50,000 rows for. Go ahead and select that, and it's going to kick off a download request. So we're going to be requesting the 50,000 items that we have for page or as many as we're able to export, in this case, the 7,000 items. At any point during the download, you can cancel it if you'd like. Once it completes, it's going to export the file for you into your browser downloads. Opening up the CSV, let's take a look at what we see. Up at the top, you'll have information about the panel, including any segmentation that was applied. Then you'll have information about the freeform table, including how many items we were able to export. As I mentioned, we export up to 50,000 items for the dimension. So if your dimension exceeds that, we'll tell you how many we're able to export here. Below, you'll see the table with the columns that you had in your table. And you'll notice that you have the 7,071 rows that were available. So that is how you download 50,000 items from Workspace. I wanted to mention one more thing. So if you have multiple breakdowns in your table, such as the example here, we're looking at marketing channels and we've broken down display by page. And then we've broken some of these pages down by browser type. Now, if we wanted to export this 3,239 items here, we could simply click any of the page rows and download items as CSV again. Taking a look at our CSV, Let's talk about how those breakdowns were handled. So the marketing channel equals display breakdown was applied as a filter to the pages exported. And the browser type that was below the page dimension was removed from the file. So the 50K download will export a single dimension and will apply all of the segments and filters above that dimension as filters in the CSV. And then any breakdowns below will be removed. So this has been an overview of how you can export up to 50,000 rows for a dimension from Analysis Workspace. We hope that this helps you guys in your analysis workflows to go beyond what you're able to see in a table in the UI and continue your analysis outside of Workspace if needed.